can't get married at the Archer Pavilion. The entire place is under five inches of water. So drain it. Hmm. It's a mess. They'll never have it ready in time for the wedding. Well, I don't understand. Did, did, it, did pipe burst or... Okay, let me guess. Someone set off the sprinkler system. You're right. The sprinkler system flooded the Archer Pavilion. Oh. Uh, okay, Carly. I don't believe that. I'm sorry. I didn't know she'd go this far. Oh, really? You didn't know she'd go this no, far? I mean, what are you talking about? She's a vindictive child. Wait, I'm not entirely following. But you don't need to. You don't need to follow any of this. Trust me, it's none of your business. You just make, you need to make sure that the venue is ready by the date of the wedding. Okay, please. but you don't understand that the damage is too extensive and it'll take at least a month to fix it. Okay, I do understand that. That's fine. Find another venue or delay the wedding. No, we're. Okay, we are not delaying the wedding. Sonny and I are getting married on February 18th, and that is final. Okay. Okay. Okay, Your Majesty, your call. I will have new venues and dresses ready for your approval by midday tomorrow. Thank you, Carol. Don't take this out on me. We can still elope. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's do it. I mean, it's fine. I just want, I want to bring all the kids. You know, I'm not leaving them out of this. I'm not letting Carly ruin this for us. Hey, do you know where Brenda was about an hour ago? With me, while Carly was at the Archer Pavilion, flooding the place. Did you, exactly. I'm at the Jason PD with Carly and brought her in for questioning. Do me a favor, Jason, for once. Do not bail Carly out. Because she, seriously, needs to be reined in. You didn't call me, so don't tell me who to call, okay? To the police station, they, they brought Carly in for the sprinklers. Well, you don't need to go. Let, let the police deal with her. No, I am going to deal with her because I, she needs to know no. that I'm on to her. What are you talking about? That's what she, she wants. She wants your attention. Uh, well, she's going to get her wish. You live with someone long enough, you know the way they think. She wants no to push idea. my button, your buttons. I'm not going to let her do so that. Clearly, I'm push back. Oh, yeah, she's clearly not pushing your buttons. This is exactly what she wants. What you need to do is you need to ignore her. No, because she's relentless. If I ignore her, it will raise the stakes. I'm going to shut her down. Out. Okay, you have pushed this too far. Don't you get it in your head that I'm marrying Brenda? You fight with her in public? You cut up her <laughs> wedding dress? You flood the pavilion? What, what else are you gonna do? Okay, a couple hours I, ago, I was taking our son to his first therapy session. You really think I would leave and go straight to the pavilion? If, if you somehow convince yourself that it was the right thing to do, hell yes. Okay, just so we're clear, if I were to stop this wedding, that would be the right thing to do. But it's, that's not your call. The hell it's not. If I would have stepped in the last time you married a whack job, Michael would have never been to prison. That's a cheap shot. It's true. Spinelli, it's Sam. Um, can you do me a favor? Jason and I need you to check all of the emails and phone records for all the guys on Brenda's guard detail. And start within the past 24 hours. That would be great. Okay, let me know what you find. Bye. Hi. Hey. Sam. Is uh, Brenda here? No, she's out with Sunny. Will she be back soon? Yeah, I, I think so. Mind if I wait? No, not at all. Go ahead. Did she tell you what happened today? Nothing specific. No. Um, someone came in here and destroyed her wedding dress. What? Yeah, I know. And if that wasn't bad enough, somebody went to the wedding site and set off the sprinklers and, and it ruined the whole thing, so now we have to look for a new venue. <sighs> well, she was upset when I saw her at the hotel, but she never said... Who would do such oh, a thing? I have no idea. The police are investigating, though, so that's good. Jason guaranteed me that she'd be safe here. Now you're telling me somebody strolled in and nobody noticed? I know. Look, we're, we're checking the video surveillance and... But where were her guards? Weren't they watching? Brenda, Sam told me what happened. 
Yeah, I am so, so sorry about the sabotage. And don't worry, Jason and I are going to do everything we can to make sure we find out who's responsible for this. Oh, are we pretending that we're looking for other suspects? Is that what we're doing? When it's obvious that it's Carly? What's up? Okay. Carly's out of control. You, you need to get her in line. Okay, Carly's not the one sabotaging the wedding. Okay, she's guilty of sin, and when you, uh, you know, when you buy into her denials, what you're doing is you're enabling her. Okay, Sonny, I think that she's telling the truth. Okay, you know she's trashed people's lives in the past. AJ, Tony Jones, now it's me and Brenda. Okay, I don't... All, all she cares about right now is Michael. Okay, I know she loves Michael to death, but for whatever damn reason, she doesn't want me to marry Brenda. And you know what? I'm tired of it. If, and she only listens to you. So just do me a favor. Talk to her. Will you? How, how's, uh, how's Brenda taking this? I told Brenda, I said, look, let's elope. Let, keep Carly out of, the, out of the picture. But she wants to get married here with the children. And I understand that. I'm begging you. Don't let Carly break the wedding. is doing everything he can to make sure your wedding goes smoothly. Thanks for helping. Oh, you're welcome. Are you sure Carly's the culprit? Um, of course I am. She has been trying to sabotage us all along. And on February 18th, I'm going to be marrying Sonny, and nothing can stop us. I will be his wife. Well, as much as I admire your conviction and, uh, Deplore what's happening. I I just keep hoping that someone or something will bring you back to your senses. Make you realize you shouldn't be marrying Sonny. Carly is not telling the truth and she's counting on you to believe her. So you gotta stop protecting yeah, her. I wouldn't protect her if I thought she did it. Okay, you're gonna stand there and tell me that she hasn't pulled anything in the past? And that you, you really think she's innocent? I, I'm saying that Carla doesn't have to go around ripping dresses and setting off sprinklers. She's already looked you straight in the eye and told you what she thought. Okay. If it's not Carly, we need to find out who did this. You know...